is Ginger. I am here with another music unboxing. The jukebox. Woohoo! But first, like I do on all the other music unboxings, I will review the two pieces of music I received in last month's box. So, I received two. <sighs> Let's see. The first one I listened to was The Green Sleeves. And the album is called As You Please. Mm, I didn't really care for this. It It's a big blur because I was like bored. Uh, it, I don't know. Maybe I'll have to give it a listen again. I don't know. This is not something you want to listen to when you're driving to work. This is not going to pump you up. It's all real kind of mellow and like slow tempo and all kinds of stuff like that. And this is more along the lines of if you want to relax and have a glass of wine. And that's usually not what I listen to music for. I don't listen to music to relax and I listen, I mean, music does relax me, but it's not something that I sit down. Oh, let me find some mellow music and have a glass of wine. No. No, I don't do that. I just usually listen to it to listen to it. That's what what I'm doing is listening to it, not drinking a bottle of wine. So, excuse me. Uh, the next one is Con Creatures. And the album is called Pretending to Swim. The music on this one, I liked the music a lot. The vocals, I have a little problem with. Um, I don't know if the vocals were like over processed, if you know what I mean, or what the deal was. It almost sounded like the guy was whispering most of the time, which was a little annoying. I really liked the music though. It had some really good music. They have really good musicianship and stuff like that, but mm, the vocals, you'll have to listen to it. It, it may be your cup of tea. I, I, I really, really, if this was all instrumental, it would have been awesome. But Mm, the vocals were a little, mm, a little too whispery, a little too overprocessed for me. So let's open up the May Jude box. This is the May box. I am a little behind on these music unboxings. But there's been a lot going on. If you guys watch my videos regularly, you probably saw a video about a week or so ago, maybe even two weeks ago. Um, about how my mom and I went to San Antonio and our room was robbed like within the first 24 hours. Uh, the first thing I see here are, ooh, some coasters. Two record coasters, it says here. So here's what it looks like. Two, oh, uh, little coasters. There they are, the little rubber coasters. They have some texture on them, like the grooves of the record. That's cute. There's a blue one and a blue one. Two blue ones. <laughs> that's cute. That That's the thing about this particular box. Um, they sort of give you like half music, half little tchotchkes. So the next item is a sticker. This is a cool sticker though. Look at that. It has all kinds of different band logos on it. It has like the Beatles, Slipknot, Kiss, U2, Metallica, Led Zeppelin, Green Day, Black Sabbath, Iron Maiden, Pink Floyd, Queen, System of a Down, Aerosmith, The Who, Nirvana. Did I already say the Beatles? That's pretty cool. Ar I think it, that even says, yeah, Arctic Monkeys. I think that's what it says. Yeah. It's a little tiny writing. But um, that's pretty cool. And it's got show me some metal. So that's pretty cool. All right. So the other thing I have here. Oh, how funny. This is a spoon. Look at that. It's shaped like a guitar with a heart at the top. Oh, how funny. This is like a... This would be like a sugar spoon or something about the size of a sugar spoon. Or if you collect spoons, I don't know if anybody does that anymore, 
I never got into collecting spoons, but like your grandmother or your great grandmother, you know, depending on how old you are, people used to be into collecting spoons. They would go to different des destinations and they would get spoons from the different states and stuff that they would uh, visit. Uh, I don't know if people still do that. I don't know. Anyway, it's a little trivia for you. <laughs> so that looks an awful lot like a collector spoon. Or you could even, if you wanted to use it, you probably have to hand wash it, but it you, this would be like a good spoon for the sugar bowl. Cool. All right, the next items are the actual music. So you get a card and it has the featured artist in it. So this one says, thank you for subscribing to the box that rocks. Do you love your jukebox? Share your love for us on Twitter and you could win a free month subscription. Be sure to include hashtag jukeboxbox. So here is the featured artist. So it says the featured artist here is Star Anna. Um, the title of the album is Alone in This Together. It says Alone in This Together showcases Seattle's Star Anna on a batch of blues infused folk songs with backing band The Laughing Dogs, the tunes also feature layered arrangements and blistering guitar solos, which give them a throwback feel and accentuate Star's soulful, I can't talk today, soulful vocals, which range from delicate to defiant and exude emotion with every note. Check out Star's critically acclaimed album, Go to Hell. Alright, so... Here is the album from the featured artist, right there, and this has 11 songs on it. Very cool. I like bluesy infused type things, so that'll be cool to listen to, and of course I'll let you guys know what I think about all these next month. So that's the first one. The next one, oh I got three this time. The next one is from a band called... The Canvas Waiting, and the title is Seasons Change. There you go. And this has two, four, six, seven songs on it. I haven't, there's no information about this one, so I have no idea what kind of music it, pop, it could possibly be. So I'm interested in listening to that. And the last one that I received is The Refrains. Two rows of pine trees. Hmm, interesting. It's got two, four, six songs on it. Cool. And I don't have any information about this one either, so I couldn't make a guess about what genre it might be. So that's everything that I received in May's jukebox. Don't forget to give this a thumbs up if you enjoy these unboxings and receiving new music. Um, I will have a link to the jukebox website so that you can go to it and check it out if you're interested in subscribing to their box. Um, it's just a link for uh, your convenience. I don't get anything for it. So um, don't forget to give this a thumbs up. I think I already said that. Uh, don't forget to check me out on Facebook and Instagram and Twitter and also I have Snapchat now. Um, all that will be listed down below as well, and I will have the information about the two CDs that I reviewed at the beginning. I'll have the information about these two artists down below as well if you want to check them out. They may be your cup of tea. So, um, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.